But before we get out of here, Missy got some theories. Yes. Um, I want to talk about some theories that I have going on. And actually, it has to do with the Cyrus family again. Absolutely nothing to do with their drama. Um, <laughs> you know, as we're seeing now, we're seeing so many artists, I guess, jump genres. Um, there's absolutely nothing wrong with it. Good observation. I, I love people um, expanding their talents and evolving and trying new things. You know, obviously, we're seeing Beyonce go into country. We're also seeing Post Malone. He's going to drop a country song. Um, there's just been tons. Who who did you say earlier? Little Nas X went from country and he's into hip hop and rap now. So anyways, um, people jump genres yeah. all the time. Somebody who I am predicting right now wants you guys to, to remember this when it happens. Right. So you heard it first. I'm predicting Miley Cyrus is going to go country. It's a prediction mm. to me. Okay. Um, hear it straight from my mouth. The reason being, um, first of all, she has a country background, right? So her dad is of a course. huge country artist. Her godmother is Dolly Parton, also a huge... I just, I just learned that today. Huge icon. Um and then let's see huge icon and so the if connection you've, if you've noticed okay so if you've noticed on the red carpet lately she has been wearing her hair so big she has she, she has been wearing it so big and that co is reminiscent off of the country genre right she so was lots just of, what award show was she just recently at her hair was just huge i don't know but i know exactly what uh, you're i'm trying about. to i'm trying to remember that what was the music remember the music yes awards, it was a music she awards on stage and got she the did. award and it was really big and yeah her hair was huge and, and it's it hasn't been just that time though there's been a couple other instances yeah. where her hair is Red really carpet. huge um wow. and i just think she's i think she's getting ready to transition so into how many country. cans of hairspray you think so that you're is. thinking it's a throwback <laughs> to like the late 80s early 90s I do. country mm. I do. well because in her godmother is dolly parton right so i mean who else is she gonna resemble like who else is she gonna gonna take off of her inspiration from of course dolly parton the amazing well let's not also forget she did have that cover of jolene which i love mm. um and that's country so that's country so mm. she's done that yeah oh, yeah man. so that's just a theory that i have um that i just I just think it's going to happen. I mean, I hope you guys remember when it does happen and be like, you know, Missy knew about that. She had an inkling. She had something in her gut in that life. said yeah. it's going to happen. <laughs> Listen to my instincts. Listen to Missy. Well, if it happens, I'm all over it because I'm all about different genres and I love country music as well. Um, so the more music they put out, the better for me. She would do amazing as a country she star. She would be amazing. She would be amazing. In fact, I would want to go to one of those concerts, to be honest. Man, I'd break out my cowboy boots. You break out your cowboy well, boots. First, I'd have to go buy them. I but already have my cowboy <laughs> boots, so that would be a first for me. I've never actually been to like a a country concert before. What? I think that would be so much fun. They I've are never been. the best. The best. Are they? Yes, they are. Who did you see? Well, my favorite that my favorite of all time that I've seen is Garth Brooks, and his show was amazing. Um, he is going back and forth the whole time. And I also love that he brought out who's what his wife. So if you don't know, he's married to Trisha Yearwood, who okay. is huge in the country She's world. She's been quiet a little bit. She hasn't, has she come she, out with she performs. She performs with him for a short period of time hmm. um, at his concerts. Anyhow, but that day that I, the last concert that I went to of his was phenomenal, phenomenal. And I was singing the whole time. And he went on longer than he was supposed to. Awesome. I love like, when artists do that. You know, he that. went off stage and everybody so awesome. was cheering encore. And he came on and he sang like for another 20 minutes. That's awesome. That awesome.